Hello everyone and welcome! It's Keeper MC and we continue our survival on the oldest anarchy server in Minecraft, tob2t.org. Um, I'm still working, nothing new, well, except I changed the textures for the moon and the sun, so instead of weird shapes they are now looking just uh, blurry circles. <laughs> and I still continue working on the project and uh, we are heavily lagging, so I'm not able to, to, to fly at the moment because I'm just hanging in, in the mid-air by some reason, but, well, something is happening for sure. Oh, thanks! <laughs> uh, but as you can see, previously small section, small corner of lava has actually expanded up until the moment it has connected with the previous lava pool. And the only thing left to be done in here is to get rid of this villager which is not willing to cooperate and fill this small section with the lava and i guess we can just go ahead and do it did it and I think he finally understood that he can actually move by himself right holy Jesus what is that what what the f oh. is that you okay <laughs> or he is glitching, but actually looking at me. Yep, probably. <laughs> In any case, it's raining again. And um, that's annoying, but I mean, nothing new. And we are still struggling with the server performance, unfortunately. But let's maybe try to give it a quick flight. Oh, especially zombies coming. Not today, boy. Or maybe today. <laughs> yep, I cannot use rockets, unfortunately. But that's the part I have added. And probably, yep. <laughs> to be to t.org. <laughs> nice. And I think it's already like a fifth time. And we can hang in the air like for, I don't know, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. Or just uh, reconnect and then try to, 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 to relaunch the elytra or just hope that the fall damage won't kill you. Uh, as you can see, my ping is above 2000 sometimes. And some people are actually reporting that there is like 12k delay. <laughs> so that's, that's weird. But nothing new. Server has already restarted at last once. But uh, nothing has improved, and some people say that it's been already like for four hours at last. Okay, let's try to reconnect. Ending connection. And now 
Wait, what? What is that? Who this? Okay. So yeah, we we basically we lagging. <laughs> uh, let me just land in any possible way because that's too much. So yeah, that's that's how it goes so far. Uh, that's the reason why I didn't manage to actually update the maps yet. But uh, I'm sure I will sooner or later. And uh, this is the bits and pieces of somebody's equipment. So we have an ender chest, crafting table and the chest full of these things. Not sure who has been in here, but for now I just left it all as it is, even the totem. And 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 and, and hopefully if we won't take their stuff, they won't destroy our stuff. How naive, right? <laughs> but we'll saw. Uh, oh wow. There's another cave. Oh, that's the one I, I'm still planning to lock eventually. You may go out. You're welcome. Uh, but yeah, what else? Um, I've been downloading the the world when I thought I I did like enough to 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 do it. And actually, speaking of those two portals, I noticed that one of those which I destroyed previously have like reappeared. And moreover, uh, it was also accompanied with two e-chests this time. So yeah, I went ahead to, to the nether, destroyed both portals, and then went back into here to destroy these ones as well. But I mean, they just keep popping. So I'm pretty sure somebody is watching us. And uh, also there is another thing which is funny. So maybe if we will make it to, to, to fly to the other side, I will show you. Let's see. Oh, wow. Uh, uh oh, <laughs> no, it was so close. Ah, uh, that's annoying. Let's try again. Position in Q second. Yeah, so many people are getting kicked because I'm pretty sure somebody, some someone is loading new chunks. Some other people probably do something in the end because yeah, it's just bad. Come on, can you click the rocket? I have prob oh my gosh, that's bad. <laughs> can we just stop? Ladies and gentlemen, infinite rockets. Okay, at last we are above the surface, not the lava. So let's just reconnect once again and see if we will be lucky to actually uh, not to die in the lava or from the fall damage. And where is the damage? Where is it? I don't trust you. Yep. <laughs> Okay, what about now? Hell yeah. So yeah, our maps are still here. And yeah, if previously we were only, um, we only covered this small section, then you may see now that also this huge part is now completed. 
And that's only because I, I abandoned the idea of uh, laying stone inside the caves for now. And not because you told me, not because I told it to myself, but actually it was even easier. Uh, in this section of the map, deep underground, I found so many lava pools. Uh, it is just crazy. These ones in the lower part was nothing in comparison to those. And uh, I mean, I covered this part already and I still have at last a few thousands of buckets uh, ready to be taken out. So yeah, this part is slowly moving on. Not sure, maybe I will update the maps later, but yeah, as you can see, for now the only way to do it is actually to uh, walk around. <laughs> because uh, we are lagging too heavily when we are trying to fly but i guess that's wait oh, i thought it was a zombie but yeah um so my signs are still here then we have this weird hole in here and by some reason our ladders are blocked with the stone either it's me with my short memory either somebody else i was not sure how to make it in here so that they let's say opened their own doors so yeah i was surprised when i was not able to find uh, the way in by some reason but well has appeared somebody else did ah great we got only four extra maybe let's switch so yeah, not, not much is happening, but yeah, slowly we are moving forward. Who did this? It was supposed to be closed. But yeah, probably I'll still continue working on the lava because at the moment, I guess that's best I can do. Uh, even despite the huge lag, it's still it is still doable <laughs> and these are those two maps it looks all right i mean around 75 percent already so we're still doing it and where is that green not really busy man ah oh, of course it's here doing nothing well done anyways i believe we are supposed to continue not sure from which side probably from that part because i'm still using this section to to gather the lava and let's see how much would be i able to do within the next few hours hopefully i will make at last three four runs so that we can increase the pools significantly and as i continue bringing lava over and over again i also started to fill this inner part right under the emptiness and well we have a small problem we have those chests staying right outside the small circle Therefore, I will move probably them inside. I already moved like, I think, four chests. Uh, just to make sure that uh, later on I won't be supposed to <laughs> destroy them full of the items. Therefore, burning down most of it. Yeah... I just think it's faster. Ugh. Maybe it's not. Anyway, so I think we are good for now at this side and here as well. So yeah, probably now I will be able to con continue laying the lava around. And if you are like worried about these chests, then please don't. Uh, as long as I will decide to remove or replace or do whatever with them, I will either block them so that goods won't fall to the lava or will just manually extract everything. So that's not an issue 
at all. So this is done and my pockets are full of whatever is inside, so I probably need to toss it all away to somewhere like in here. Yeah, and this is the minor part of the chest I freed up and I think I placed now like something around 25 double chests already, like for the dirt, for the stone and for the cobblestone somewhere as well, so yeah. Uh, all right, what's up? What's next? Well, I guess I need to put my axe back as I won't need it for the moment. Well, at the moment. And now I need to... I will cut this off. And now I need to go and empty my shulker boxes. Full with the lava. Perfect. Let's go. So, this is where we start. And this is how it looks like when all the buckets are empty. Well, maybe not that much, but another almost a thousand of buckets have arrived so yeah as you can see i finished those lines which were not completed and full also finished this section and well all of my shulker boxes are empty containing nothing else but the thin air and the buckets themselves ah uh, yeah it's not coming that fast, but the lava pools are endless and I keep discovering more and more. So probably I will just go ahead and bring some more, because why not? Uh, these lava pools, oh my. They're just endless. Whenever you are going, there is a huge field of lava. That's good. I'll get a lot and we'll finish the project. That was weird. <laughs> because why not? Because why not? Because why not? And this little why not actually took me probably more than two weeks. Ugh, but it's done. At last some part of it. I already managed to die twice in my own lava pool <laughs> because as you know elytra is not always working as you expect it to work and both times i forgot that i need to set my spawn point so without the bed i was supposed to also go back from the spawn and yeah, as you can see, this is the last corner we have to fill with the lava, which is still a huge part. But I think it's finally less than 25%. So. Let's see, we have a minimap right in here. Uh, will it... No, I need to fly with it. Okay, let's do it quickly so as you can see <laughs> on the minimap it finally starts to look better huge amount of lava has been already brought in but there is still lots to go 
And luckily I discovered a huge system, like another huge system of lava pools. So the only task here is to run back and forth. And I wonder actually about the numbers. Let me quickly do some math to see how much we actually brought in. So yeah, I did some quick calculations and it seems that um, since the last time I've been releasing the video and like uh, showing up the, 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 the lava pool, uh, I actually managed to bring in something around 15 thousands of buckets. Uh, which is roughly like 13% of the whole uh, lava pool. And sadly, there is still a lot to be done. Uh, specifically, uh, 19,000 and like 50, probably like 20,000 of buckets still to be brought in, which is around like 17%, which is still not that bad actually so let's just quickly refresh the maps to see how is it gonna look like Boom. <laughs> not bad not bad not bad at all oh, it's finally taking its shape it was oh. <laughs> but yeah seventeen thousands or something is still to be brought in and uh, now I think I'm actually busy in some upper sections uh, on the map, so the, the lava is coming from there. And yeah, this time I'm going like really messy, very irresponsible, I would say, because I'm just digging the tunnels, discovering the lava pools, and then just, just try to get it out, all of it, without caring about, let's say, the terrain. But I do hope that eventually I will have that time so that I can just uh, grab out all of the resources and like fill it with the stone because yep, some other projects will require resources anyways. But not now, let's, let's try to focus. And yeah, I really hope that by the next episode I would be finally able to complete the lava pool and start slowly terraforming the rest of the terrain, shaping them, let's say hills, replanting trees, burnt down by the thunderstorms, etc, etc. Oh, and yeah, well, currently we are testing the uh, updated, let's say, version. So the test server is running and uh, it was promised to, to, to be like that for like a few weeks at last and well, few weeks already passed so <laughs> it could be that at any given moment in between of these episodes the server will finally upgrade which would be amazing but well I am scared because you know I would be supposed to eventually dig twice as deeper hole in the ground I mean it would for sure look much better this way if uh, the depth of the uh, emptiness would be bigger because I'm not super excited to see such a small walls. I would love them being higher. But well, this is what it is at the moment and who knows, maybe it's gonna stay like that. Maybe we'll get an upgrade finally. Not sure, not sure. But I guess we will see. And uh, once again guys, I thank you so much for watching. Uh, thank you so much for being here with me. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to ask them either directly in Twitter, either in Discord, either right here down below the comments on YouTube. In any case, guys, I hope to see you back in the next episode. Bye-bye, everyone.